And hello YouTube and welcome back to another episode of The Zone TV Movie Entertainment with me your host Jonathan once again bringing you my thoughts and review for last night's episode of Black Lightning Season 2 Episode 11. Big spoilers are coming people so if you haven't seen it I highly recommend you go and watch it and then come back here and watch my review. So big spoilers. So anyway. So when we last left Black Lightning we found Khalil on the streets near the church where he grew up in with his spine literally ripped off and basically he goes into the hospital everybody's waiting to see if they can try to fix him and it, it was just basically a waiting game of oh is Khalil gonna die is he gonna survive how can we fix him you have Jennifer grieving and, and feeling guilty the fact that it was kind of like her fault that they had to go go on the run in the first place you have Jefferson still trying to find a way to get Tobias and making him pay for what he did to not only to Khalil but also to the people of Freeland and of course his own father. His cop friend goes with him to the tailor shop where Gambini works. He showed him all the secrets. He told him everything so they kind of do like a little undercover thing to get information about Tobias. But the man is pretty much the most squeakiest clean person on the planet. So they need to try to find some kind of evidence against him to use again, you know, to use against him. And then of course we got some moments with his little new intern boy. I'm telling you, this intern guy, he makes Curtis from Arrow look like an amateur. I'm telling you, this kid had technology that I, I never even seen in, in in pop culture like that. That 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 kid is like like he's in Candyland. He's he's become Tobias' a second right man. It's ridiculous. And this kid thought he was getting an internship here. And kind of sad that eventually he probably will die. You Knowing him, he probably will screw up and die eventually. But uh, right now, this kid is on the top of the world. He's leading um, charge of second command, pretty much. He's breaking out of people out of prison. Just so, so bias can meet these people. It's crazy that we see this. And um, yeah, this kid's in the high note right now. But... Yeah, by the end of the season, he probably will die. And then, of course, we got to see Jennifer literally using her powers and almost losing control of it until their, their, her parents' family friend comes, helps her out. And then, of course, we got to the point where Jennifer tries to ask her mom, oh, can we put um, Khalil in one of the pods to save him? And it's pretty much too late. Khalil dies. And, um... Yeah, it was pretty sad seeing him die. He was a cool character. But um, I, I didn't think he would have died. I thought they would have saved him somehow. I thought Jennifer would have used her powers to maybe try to save him. But um, no, nope, he died. He's dead now. So I don't know what's going to happen moving forward with the next episode. But it looks like Jennifer is probably going to start getting ready to use her powers more. And hopefully suit up. And... Um, maybe try to get revenge on Tobias but um yeah so rest in peace Khalil he was a cool character and um yeah that, that's pretty much the gist of what happened so um leave a comment below let me know what you guys thought about it and what do you think of Khalil's passing you think you think he should have never died you think he should have just been alive because honestly I thought if they would have fixed him he would have lost his powers but mm. Oh, well, what can you do now? So, leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys thought. Thank you very much, and have a good day.